first heard about Sawyer, uh, the first product that came to mind was our new high volume roadway light fixture. This is a product that customers are buying tens of thousands of to relamp their entire streets and highways. This is the line that we need to get high output and high quality of product. So an automation device like Sawyer is a great strategy for that line, helping to take repetitive tasks that our operators do every day and by automating them, we protect our employees and also help to increase the speed of the line. The challenge is to get our operators on the floor used to automation. Rather than it being a scary robot coming to take their jobs, Sawyer is really a tool for them, and he's helping assist our operators to do their job safer, you know, more ergonomically, and to increase efficiency. The biggest difference between a Sawyer and an industrial robot uh, would be in the programming. It was impressive as how easy it was to program the machine for pickup points and placement points and it hit the mark the way it was supposed to. We will be implementing Sawyer in areas where it has a highly repetitive task or, or mundane task to help free up our operators to do more important functions in their work cells. Up until now, robots haven't had much impact on logistics due to the complexity of work. But that's changing because the technology is becoming advanced enough. And this is the reason why we have Sawyer here, one of the most advanced collaborative robots on the market. Instead of programming, I'm actually showing and teaching the robot what he has to do, where he has to pick and place something, which is easy as setting up your own smartphone. Using sensing technology enables us to deploy robots in an environment together with people. An industrial robot wouldn't stop if he sees an obstacle. However, this robot is detecting if something's getting in his way, and therefore stopping, which enables us to use robots in a safe way. <laughs> 